Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Windows 11 and even Windows 10 has a small little feature. If we head into our system about page, that is called frequently asked questions. There we go. And I think this is more for your not so tech savvy person where you can see the FAQs that Microsoft answers that I think are most asked by your so-called novice or average Joe users. Am I running the latest version of Windows OS? Is my GPU sufficient for high-end gaming? I have an old PC. Would upgrading to a more powerful PC enhance my experience? And how does having 4 to 8 gigabytes of RAM impact my PC's performance? So those are basically the general questions. Now, as I posted earlier this week, Microsoft rolled out the latest optional bug fix update for Windows 11, 25, and 24H2, KB5070311. And as spotted and posted by Windows Latest, the FAQs, Frequently Asked Questions, is now starting to roll out as Device Insights, additional information about your device. Now, as you can see, I haven't received it yet. This wasn't officially noted in the change log and the release notes. So it does seem to be something Microsoft is enabling using a server-side update after that update has been installed. And I'll leave the video for KB5070311 linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like more info because there was quite a lot going on and a big update. And then over and above changing frequently asked questions to device insights, everything else looks exactly the same. The questions and the answers, give or take, are doing more or less the same thing. So I think this is actually quite handy for your average Joe who wants to know a little bit more about different hardware components and isn't so tech savvy. I have said this previously when Microsoft first rolled out FAQs. And naming it from FAQs to device insights, I can see why they're doing it. It's more about your device and insights about your device. So I can see why Microsoft is making that name change, but nonetheless, a small little change. And just wanted to put it out there in case you were unaware or had spotted it and didn't know why the change had happened. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.